over here. Is there anything good that comes out of this? Okay, now this reminds me of, um, actually it reminds me of a lot of maps. What the f Now this, my friend, you may be wondering what just happened there. Well, if you look back at the cliff once more, you will see. No, I'm not gonna play it for you again. You're gonna have to look back and watch it yourself. Sorry, harsh but true. Now, if you paid very close attention, you would see that the Pyro 3 gas passed around me and put out a Neon Annihilator. That is the exact reaction that I had with that what the f moment. Now, you stop and think about it. What made this Pyro want to have the idea to pull out a gas passer and a Neon Annihilator at the same time? Well, my friend, welcome to the 2023 Summer Update. Fuck, I said 2023, goddammit. The 2024 summer update. As we have 10 new maps, a shit ton of cosmetics, a little robot butler, dude, that's adorable as fuck. And the gas pass buff. No, 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 stop, stop, stop. Don't, don't go freaking out just yet. I know that you're over here. I did not hear this man right here. Let me, let me grab you gently. Pull yourself a little bit closer to me. Yeah, sound better? I bet it does. The gas pass buff update. Good. I'm glad that we were able to get that settled and you were actually hear me. So, um, yeah, that happened entirely. Uh, nothing much to really say about it. I mean, I have two game clips of me trying to use it. I mean, it's not as effective as I would like it to be but uh i did have some talking over said gameplay over on obs so if the mic does sound a little bit better or worse in quality now you know so uh let's continue on with the video just wanted to go and let you guys know in on that Well, 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 what do we have here? The gas passer, the neon annihilator, and the best thing of all. L air blast. Spider, what the fuck are you doing, you may be asking? Well, however, I refuse to answer that. Why do I refuse? Because it's very simple, my friends. Very, very simple indeed. You see, I sit here to get a good charge on this gas passer. Actually, let me go ahead and do this. Let me cook up some good old kills real quick you know nothing nothing too much of course but you see I have oomph and I also have gas yes well let me tell you something about this little buddy we all know an MVM you throw this at a good old pile of robots what do they do they explode they fucking go kaboom nothing bad ever happens now however you get some of wet wit what is that my friends well you see this is the exact same thing as you getting an underwater kill. That's right. The gas passer got a buff. Now, you may be wondering, I don't see the buff. What do you mean? Well, let's see something. Well, that's 52. That's also 52. That's also 52. And that takes four shots to kill the man. Well, that doesn't seem very fair, now, does it? That takes a pretty good amount of time. And knowing it, soldier's reaction time could be anywhere. Now, let's do this. What the fuck? That wasn't even in the script. I'm- huh? Was it because I threw it at him and not- What the fuck? Back to, uh, you know, as I was saying. See that little soldier boy? Yeah, you know him. Now let's try this. He's doused. Bap. Bap. That takes only two. Why? Because if you can read like any other good-minded person, you will be able to see that the gas passer has a new buff. Now, as you can see, it doesn't say right here. Spawning and resupply do not affect the gas meter. Gas meter starts empty. Gas meter builds with damage done and or over time. But, hmm, it doesn't say anything about being able to do this, now does it? The answer is no. Why? Does it take so long to kill? We're just using just an Neon Annihilator. Well, it's very simple. It's shit. Everybody knows it's shit. You use it in a public, you know, it's not, it's not really gonna work out the way you want it to. 
But you bring out this, the beautiful canister, the one and only thing that you could really truly desire most to get that satisfying kill with the dumbest weapon in all of TF2 that makes you a furry. Ignore that last part, I just wanted to target certain pyromanes. But no, and with all seriousness, grab a medic, first whack, don't do it, hit it again. Why does it bounce? I okay, you throw it at them? I don't know. Bap, one tap. Even though they're not fully splashed, you can still catch them mid-fire. See, you do some damage to the pyro, it, it's not working. You gotta hit them four good times. You don't like that four. So instead, you go to the heavy. Ugh, 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 nothing. So what you do? Yeah, it just bounces off that. Okay, that's cool. You go to the heavy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You don't want to swing seven times. No, 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 my good friend. You got to body blight this medic here. You're going to get that full charge. You're going to get that. You're going to get that good old gas passer going. Yes, sir. You got a scout. He's uh, he's really hurt. You know, and you just got to. Uh, yeah, you got you to gotta finish him off because you know you weren't going to have enough time to WM1 scout. Is not the weakest class, however. Spy that I just fucking eviscerated is. You know how long that takes to kill a spy? Here, let me let me let me bring it to your attention. Let me let me let me show you guys a little bit of something. So we know it takes seven hits with heavy. Now, one, two, three, four. That is sufficiently better. It has a damage buff. Congrats, you figured that out by now. Now why is the video so long, you may ask? Well, my friends. Well, my good old friendy friend friends. You know the answer already. I gotta use this in pubs. You, no, no, no. You you think I'm just gonna sit here on walkway and I'm just gonna waste my life away showing you this dumb strat over and over on different classes? No, no, no. I'm putting this shit out in the world to see. I'm bringing this out for everybody to see. Bringing your mama with me. One tap of fucking spy. One tap of spy in public humiliate them make them see what big grave mistake valve has led on to us medic app gone scout you, yeah you you get a pass buddy you little fast fuck let me also play yourself a little bit of something you think oh well that's cool i guess i mean you could get rid of the other classes let's go with pyro the also known as the flame retardant yes he also does not tend to take as much damage to Fire. You can see it does 20. Let's walk over to Heavy. How much do you take, good sir? You take a good bit. He does not have Afterburn. Very nice and very well made. You can see that was a couple of ticks there. So meaning of which he'll take sufficiently so much more than just 20. He's going to take about a good 28, 30, 30 something. It's just going to take a good chunk out of his health. But uh, you get yourself a Pyro. You gas him. Hit him. And then bap. Look at that. 156 plus burn. And he's dead. You only had to hit him once. Let the afterburn take care of it. Besides from that, this thing is completely useless. Gas pass is completely useless until used against anyone. Take it to heavy. We've already done this. It's a four. So now, let's get right on into the actual gameplay. See, so now we've went ahead and queued for casual. As we already know, there's going to be some annoying pyros anyways. So, what makes my gameplay different? You see, it's not too entertaining when you're having to chase anybody around with a flog and doing nothing but wait till that little gas can fills. You get something that does the most damage and you just rack up the kills, right? Wrong. Use flog. Why flog? That is a great question. Why flog indeed? Well, let me make it real simple to you. Because flog lets you do crits. And if you charge those crits and please sneaky the entire time, that only leaves you one thing to do. And to rack up that damage. And while you're racking up said damage, you tend to, you guessed it, get more damage points. Once you get more damage points, the faster that the gas tank recharges. The faster that recharges, the faster we're able to do the funny. Even though you do respawn, it does not, re it does not stay empty. It will reset after each spawn. Okay, maybe I lied about that. Maybe we don't need to use that. Maybe we need to use something like, you know, uh, what is it? A bag burner. Yeah. Actually, let's do the Dragon Sphere. You see, 
Instead of using the Phlogisonator, a good idea to use is the Dragon's Fury. Why, you may ask. Spider, elaborate. You're holding onto a Neon Annihilator, a Gas Passer, and a fucking Dragon's Fury. Well, you see, it stacks. If you don't get killed by Sticky Pops. That is the only problem. You have an enemy team to worry about. Of course, they're gonna see you. You're a slow, dumb pyro who doesn't know what they're doing. You expect them to be blind and not see that you're trying to pull some new thing, knowing that the fucking game just dropped a new mechanic. They don't, you don't, you don't think that they're trying to get you because they did, because they know that you know this. No, 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 my friend. That's where you're all wrong. Of course they're gonna target you. A new buff just dropped. All the furries are coming out of their basements, holding onto the gas passes proudly and screaming, One of us, one of us, and please do not let us combust. However, that's not gonna be likely for them, because, uh, they know distance very well. However, they don't know how to channel said distance. They don't know how far you're gonna push. They don't know how far you're gonna hold back. They don't understand your thought process. So what makes you think that they're not gonna try and stop you? That's the dumb part. Of course they're gonna stop you. They're a opposing team. It's not like they're friendly. Fuck you too for the joyers who ruin everything by going friendly for no damn reason. I hate it. I want to just play the fucking game, get it done and over with. So with this information, the only thing that you can truly do is just catch someone off guard. It's the opportunity that's just not gonna walk up to you and be like, Hey, fucking kill me. Her, 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 her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have a, have a free kill, guys. No, that's not how this works at all. None. Zilch. Not a, not a damn one of these is gonna go, Here, kill me. Uh, uh, uh. No, you're really funny. If you're thinking that you can get some sly kill for a YouTube video and be like, cool, I did it. I can now post up I can now upload this and post it and say I got content. That's what I've been doing for the past 30 minutes or so, trying to get content from this. And as you can see, we're already at 30 seconds left and our card has not moved from the point once. So what does that mean? Disconnect, requeue, find a dumbass fucking team just for you to ruin their day.